Well, this weekend, officers are tracking down safety problems on the water, including drunk boaters. Michael Locklear joins us live with a DUI arrest and what you should check before your next trip to the lake. Michael? Officers with Utah State Parks are ramping up enforcement on the boat ramps as part of this three-day blitz, and we were there as a lieutenant made the first arrest. Lieutenant Drew Patterson is on patrol at Jordanell Reservoir. We're going to do a quick vessel inspection. Patterson and five other officers are making sure everyone is boating safely. We've had a number of drownings this year already across the state. The biggest thing that we find are undersized life jackets, you know, that uh, an adult has a kid life jacket that doesn't fit them. Officers are also taking part in the national campaign Operation Dry Water. Obviously, you've got some alcohol here. As they look to pull drunk boaters off the water, most people are out enjoying the day. It was phenomenal. It was my first time in a boat. It was really fun, you know. Spending the 4th of July weekend, it's always a great time to be out on the water, wake surfing, wakeboarding. So. But for one operator... How much have you had to drink today? I've had three beers in the last four hours. In the last four hours? Yeah. Okay. A fun day. I'm going to explain and demonstrate the test, and I don't want you to start until I ask you to begin, okay? Ended with a sobriety test. Okay, go ahead and just follow it straight up. One, two. Okay. Faster? One, two. He would not pass. Um, he is placed okay, under arrest for DUI. At least we got him, get him off Bravo. the water today. The first is officers target several popular spots for boating. Last of the weekend, expect to see officers at Willard Bay, Bear Lake, and Flaming Gorge as well. Again, critically important to have good life jackets for everyone. And on top of that, some of the common problems spotted tonight include having expired registration or an expired fire extinguisher. Both those led to warnings and citations tonight. Live in Salt Lake City, Michael Locklear, KSL 5 News. All right. Thanks a lot. Good information, Michael.